Hi, my name is Peter Bianchi. I'm the uh, graduation coordinator here at Cures Arge Regional High School, and I have been fielding some questions as of late regarding the uh, the seating and how the seating is going to work uh, at, at this Saturday's graduation ceremony. So I'd like to take a little bit of time here in this video just to explain what uh, what we're thinking uh, is going to how it's going to work and how uh, um, how you all be, will be able to uh, you know w work your uh, work your guests into however n n many uh, seats you need. Um, so this is what we're looking at here is a map of the, uh, uh, the audience and uh, some of the, uh, we don't really see the stage here, but the stage would be toward the bottom of the screen where my little highlighter is. And then up here, just sort of for a point of reference, this is where the, this is the center aisle of the, uh, of the audience. And back up here, is, is, this is where the press box would be on the football field, for those of you that know the field. So it's kind of centered on that press box. And the little squares here, num with, which are broken into groups K, R, H, and S, uh, the little squares are where the graduates are going to be sitting. And then the uh, rectangular regions with the matching uh, letters and numbers are going to be where they're reserved, randomly assigned uh, reserved seating areas are going to be. Each graduate will get six tickets and to sit in, the, in, in one of these reserved, uh, reserved areas. And the uh, reserved areas are going to be, give you, uh, whoever's there is going to have a really good kind of in-person uh, line of sight to their graduate marching in uh, to the ceremony. Because uh, unlike uh, in pre, unlike pre-COVID uh, graduations here at Kearsarge, well, we're actually marching them down four aisles. We're, we're breaking the class into four groups and we're marching them down four aisles. And as such, everybody that, you know, as, as we look at, let's take a look at group K here, right? The student section here, this, that's group K. And here are where all of group K's guests are going to be situated. And Group K, the Group K graduates, will march down this uh, uh, aisle right here. And uh, I don't have my, uh, <laughs> my oh, well, there you go. Straightens it right out for me. How about that? Um, all of uh, the, the graduates in Group K are going to march down that aisle. So everybody in those uh, reserved seats are going to have a really good view of their graduate marching in. Uh, same with each of the subsequent groups. Um, the uh, group R is going to march down this group, this aisle here. So everybody's here uh, with the um, in, in section R from the audience reserved uh, section is going to have good, really good view. It looks more spread out on the plan than it does in reality. Uh, it's not that spread out. We, we from last year, if, if you looked at last year's video, it's going to look similar to that, uh, the the 2021 graduation, uh, and it's really not that. You're not going to be that far. Uh, you're going to be far closer than you could be if we had marched everybody down that center aisle. If everybody for instance, walk down this aisle here, like we traditionally have done in the past, um, then you know you might be as far away as here uh, watching your your graduate march in. So uh, you're actually getting a better uh, a better vantage point of your graduate marching in. And here's Group H, um, and it's all based on alphabetical uh, last by last name. Uh, all depends on where your where your graduate is, and this is just for the reserve seating. Right? Again, reserve seating has been randomly assigned. There's no rhyme nor reason to it, um, and then uh, so it doesn't necessarily match up with your graduate's number. So if your graduate, for instance, is instance is sitting in S1, um, if they're right here, that does not mean that you're sitting right there. Uh, it doesn't doesn't match up like that. Uh, we just wanted to just make it completely random. Um, so that that is what we've done, and that's for the reserve seating. That's six reserved uh, guests. So what you'll do is you'll go to the uh, when you check in uh, at the uh, at one of the four tables that have your your ticket will have your uh, your graduate's name and then your uh, your seat assignment. 
you'll go to either K, R, H, or S table, and then a usher will bring you to your seat where you'll find uh, a lawn sign, uh, a complimentary lawn sign you get to take home with your graduate's name on it. And uh, then you get your six seats as, as uh, um, for, for, for the ceremony. And um, yeah, that would be that would be that. If you have more than six guests, which is a, comp a total uh, a po complete possibility, a lot of people are, are wanting to bring more, and you can. Uh, they'll just have to find space in some of the general seating areas uh, that we'll have. Um, I'm pretty confident that you know we'll have pe we'll have general seating over here. This is kind of the the, the uh, uh, scoreboard side of the football field, and this is the uh, that's not what I want. Uh, this is the um, school side, on the other hand, um, right here. And so that's going to be kind of on either behind the reserve seating. Um, there may or may not be seats here. It all depends on how far onto the field I can move. We can move the uh, the uh, on the staging and all that stuff. There's there's a lot of stuff that's not on the uh, on the uh, the map here, just so I could fit it on this this screen. Um, but uh, I, I, there may be room behind some of these uh, reserve seats here. Um, but the bleachers in front of the press box are available too. And that's, those offer a pretty, actually a pretty good vantage point as they're elevated. Uh, you can, you can kind of see, see over the crowd. But uh, just remember that we also have two very large uh, screens, uh, daylight LED screens that will allow us to kind of there really won't be a bad seat in the house. That's that, that's not a cliche. That's the reality. Uh, you'll be able to see everything um, uh, from from really wherever you are. So there may be in these non-reserved uh, seating areas. There may be some chairs uh, available, but uh, feel free to bring your own uh, if you want. Uh, it, you can bring bag chairs or lawn chairs, things like that. Uh, we just ask that you do not sit on the um, do not sit on the track. Uh, that will uh, we don't want to tear up the the rubber uh, off the track with uh, with the, with the chairs. Um, but you can send the bleachers. You can stand on the track if you want to watch it from the track. Well, oftentimes people stand. It's not a long ceremony. It's about an hour and fifteen minutes. Um, so uh, you know, wh whatever whatever works for 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 you. If you want to guarantee that you have a seat, uh, make sure you know you can certainly bring your own uh, if if you wish. Um, we'll have some, but in the general admission areas, it'll be kind of first come, first serve. Um, and um, if we could, if you could plan to be in your seats before the one o'clock start of the ceremony, ideally we'd like the, the one o'clock to be when we are sending the graduates down the aisles, which is actually, they're not the first ones to go down the aisles. Um, the uh, the faculty march in ahead of them as the as does the uh, administration that sits on the stage, so they will be marching in ahead. So uh, we would like to be starting pomp and circumstance for the graduates at one o'clock, meaning we will would have already sent some people down. So if you could plan to be there, at, you know, about quarter of one, that would be that would be helpful. Obviously, uh, if you can't, you can't. It's not the end of the world, but. Um, that would be uh, that would be great, and um, I think that's about everything. I think I fielded the questions that I've had. If you have others, please don't hesitate to reach out. My name is Peter Bianchi, and you can email me at p bianchi p b i a n c h i at cursarge.org, and I'll do my best to answer your questions as quickly as I can. Thank you.